Hey guys. So I just wanted to show you how the last part of my hair looks with my makeup. I did a little tutorial earlier. <laughs> and I'm using purple lighting. <laughs> so I hope you guys like it. Um, I just want to give a little motivational Monday message. <laughs> MMM. Motiv motivational Monday message. <laughs> Triple M with Maya, quadruple M, <laughs> and I just want to give you guys hope. Um, it's Monday, so I wanted, um, what should I talk to you guys about? I would just say, all things work, the, the scripture that's on my heart is all things, all things work out for those who love the Lord. <laughs> I remember what it said. <laughs> I mean, what it said. I'm just saying, all things work for those who love the Lord. So don't stress. Know that God has your back through all things. So knowing that, like, um, if you work hard as well, faith without works is dead. So do all that you can do with your works, but also have the faith behind it. Sometimes, usually people have the opposite, where they're like, they have all the faith and they don't do the works. So I'm that more the opposite. Sometimes I do all the works and then I don't have the faith. Like, you're hustling and bustling, but sometimes you don't feel like you have the faith behind it. I think you have to have both. Remember, as much as you're hustling and grinding it out, have the same amount of faith with that. And if you're the opposite type of person where you have a lot of faith and you don't do a lot of works, know that you won't be able to get where you need to go with that. I'm going like this because I'm still on my knees, guys. <laughs> you you won't be able to go where you need to go without working and grinding hard. So have a, I, you know, have a, a, a equal parts, a high equal parts of, um, of working hard and, um, grinding hard too so um i just want to give hope to those who are in that you know especially with covid the stimulus check will be cut soon um use it wisely use it very smartly as well um and continue to grind guys continue to grind 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 don't give up as well don't you know regardless of how things may be looking um don't don't focus on what it looks like focus on the acts and the prayer and what you're doing behind what it looks like don't let the what it looks like on the outside deceive your mind as well don't let things around you or things what people say what people do what it looks like disrupt what you're doing in the future know that all things work out for those who love the lord so love the lord making sure that you stay consecrated in him Stay happy, stay positive, don't let nothing sway what you do. <laughs> um, just say, you know, just stay encouraged during this time. And um, hone in more on your craft, too, um, as well. Like, for me, YouTube and makeup and art was is a great way to hone in your craft. Like, use, use um, sometimes the most beautiful art things are birthed during times of disruption, you know? disruption is always a birthplace like when you're birthing like when people have when mothers have birth it's during a disruption period so no use that period as a consecration period to really birth something new birth birthing something new the new project um use this as a time to 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 innovate and to create and to really do what you want to want to really do um I would say that. And also, um, keep your eyes on the Lord. <laughs> My eyes. <laughs> keep your eyes on the Lord. You know, we're going to put these earrings in. Keep your eyes on the Lord. Um, it, it sounds so cliche, but it's like, you know, seriously do that because there's so many wild distractions out there. And, um, you know, you got to just keep your, you got to keep your mind right money right you're ready for war you know what i'm saying and to keep your mind right this earring to keep your mind right um you got to keep it with god like praying and fasting and um doing um what god has called you to do like just being able to be in the word listening to pr preachers you know praying throughout the day not just in the morning and at night throughout the day like just keeping your mind that way 
because part of success is keeping your mind right. Jay Z and, and all these people and, and people who are successful ain't successful with no reason. They got to keep their mind right too. So keep your mind in the word of the Lord <laughs> and with good people around you. Um, you know, and that's why it's even though it might sound corny and whatever, that's keeping your you got to recycle and detox all the negativity out of you. So, um, I would say doing that is very important during times of disruption, t- times of things that are birthing new things. You have to keep your mind, you got to be very cognizant of what's around yourself the people, the place, the atmosphere, what you're listening to, what everything that you're putting into yourself. Um, what else? <laughs> um, and I do my makeup. I like to stay. Sometimes people keeping yourself right, keeping yourself looking good, healthy, working out, putting that lipstick on, girl. <laughs> keeps your mind right too. You know what I'm saying? Keep looking good helps your mind right. If you look you're good and you see yourself looking good, that keeps your mind right too. Get up in the morning. I know everything is COVID and you don't have to really put makeup on and get ready. Do that for yourself. Do that. You should have you should never have been getting ready for other people in the first place. When you go out to the to when it was non COVID, when you're going to your office. You shouldn't have been doing that for other people. Do it for yourself. Do it for yourself because you want to keep your you when you get ready, when you see yourself looking good, when you see yourself looking right and you're working out, that that makes it that that just changes the frequency and the energy as well. So just do that as well for yourself, you know. Don't do it for other people. Do it for yourself. And um what else was I gonna say? <laughs> um, yeah, just pray up um to Jesus. Um be smart be be very strategic too like don't don't just be frivolous and don't go don't go with your feelings during times of disruption go with be very thoughtful and plan and and sometimes yeah i'm all about going with the flow and stuff but when you're doing when you're in a season of um of, of new birthing something new and innovative um, you really need to be strategic and smart about how you were um, positioning yourself. You know what I'm saying? So um, it's very important to not be discretionary with how you're positioning yourself and who you're positioning yourself with. So it's very important to, you know, to do that and be very really smart. And God's timing is, is always the right timing. It might not be looking the right way. It might not look the right way you think. But know that his way is always the right way. And it's going to be the right way. And it's going to all work out. All things work for his purpose at the end of the day. So do that. Um, child. <laughs> and don't feel like... Be, and I feel like one thing... Some people think because you're in COVID. People who are being in, you know, in the COVID... Um, mess and going through that that you have to look a mess and feel like a mess because you're in a mess no child if anything <laughs> child if anything that's the time to 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 be the the total that's when you need to put on when the way you put on clothes you gotta put on positivity put on joy put on happiness you know you don't have to look like your circumstances if anything you should be looking the opposite so I, i'm tired of people feeling like okay because you're going through hell with this covid and all this stuff you have to look the way that your circumstance is telling you no literally in order sometimes to change your circumstance you got to put on happiness put on joy put on lipstick <laughs> and i'm just saying lipstick because that's putting on that joy put it on and praying you got you can't just let things affect you, you got to be the um, not be reactive, but be proactive in, tr- in, in setting the atmosphere in a different way, guys. And um, I think it's very, very important during seasons like this that you are proactive in um, setting a new pace, seriously. And um, not just letting things happen to you that you can change. You can change it. Um, so, you know, and there's so many bad things. There is, COVID is disgusting. I understand. I understand completely. There's people who have died in my family from COVID in New York, in Harlem, in, Bro- in the Bronx, in Brooklyn.